Finance Minister is expected to present the 2023 budget to Parliament in two days' time, that's Thursday. But the man to do so, Ken Oferiata, has been asked, and in fact, is still being asked to resign or the president should sack him. Already, the minority side has filed a censure motion against him. The ad hoc committee, which was set up by the speaker to probe this motion, has ended its sittings and is currently working on the draft report to be presented to the plenary for debate. From the majority side also, some 89 MPs have also indicated that they will not take part in the budget and other government-related business if it is the finance minister who will present the budget. So, if the finance minister goes ahead and presents the budget on Thursday and there is a boycott, what will be the implications? If the majority side is in support of this, what it means is that on that day, if they decide to walk out, I can assure you that there wouldn't be any budget presentation. Because we will know also to relate that. We are already saying that he should be sacked. If he comes to present the budget, we will have to approve the, the principles, and that will require a certain number of us sitting in there and approving it. So that will not be done. He won't get that approval. And if he doesn't get the approval, we cannot even move on to do the debates. And we cannot move on to do the estimates. So there wouldn't, be, there wouldn't be any budget. It's as simple as that. All of us as a house should make it abundantly clear that we are not ready for him to come and present the budget to us. Is he the only man? You have the men. You have the men, you have the men. Where are the men? We should be resolved that if he is going to present the budget, we should all work out for him and make sure that the signal goes out that we are not prepared. And not only work out, but the budget will not be passed. In the face of our presence with the IMF, I don't think that can change him. We've raised a lot of issues. Uh, on the floor, which has occasioned our censoring him, which has been referred to the committee, and most of these issues have been brought out. And so, even though he attempted to respond to some of those things, we know that you are just responding for respons uh, uh, responding sake. And so, we don't expect anything new uh, from him. Members from the majority side, however, remained tight-lipped about their next move on Thursday.